Okay, Rita, check this out. I'm on my way to another horse show, this time in Falsterbo, Sweden. I've already left Fechte, driven about three and a half hours, and I am waiting in line for this ferry ship that you can see up there. I'm gonna drive the truck into the belly of that ferry with my horse on it, and we're gonna cross over um, from Germany into Denmark, and then drive on toward Copenhagen. Look who's about to get a fresh hay net. So if you notice all the traffic driving in the opposite direction, these are trucks and cars coming off the ferry that just pulled into the port. And then we're going to load all of the trucks and cars you see in front of me here onto the ferry and cross. We are at a port called Hutgarten in the north of Germany. We're going to cross on the ferry to Rogby, which is in, on the southernmost Danish island. Then I'm going to drive up to Copenhagen and cross on the bridge over to Malmo in Sweden. Okay, check this out. I am driving into the belly of a ship with my horse and the truck. Check it out. So, we're leaving Germany now. Horses below decks in the truck. And we're making the crossing over to Denmark. This is a cafeteria aboard the ship. There's also duty-free shopping aboard this boat, and a coffee shop, and all a bank. So I just sat down in one of the restaurants to have lunch, and um, this is the direction toward Denmark that we're sailing. I hope we're not on a collision course with this barge, but I think the captain knows what he's doing. That's another ferry going the opposite direction that just crossed our path. That's what ours looks like from the outside. Okay, the port of Rugby is coming into view. We're all about to land in Denmark. So we've reached Falstabo and we're on our way into the horse show along the beach here. And I just wanted to show you that the um, beach is lined with these incredible bronzes. Look who's here. So we're all moved into the stables at Falstabo, and I'm about to do a training round on Vinyamato. There he is, it's Win-Win. Hi, Schnooky. I brought you apples. So this is Jumping Arena at the Falstabo Horse Show. We do have a U.S. team here for the Grand Prix jumping. I'll be able to get some of that later. Sponsoring tent over there. If you're having problems seeing a certain jump, you can watch it on the big screen <laughs> up there. Okay, so at Falsterbo, you will see just, well, it's an enormous trade fair. And it's always packed elbow to elbow with tons of people. This is a vacation city, so there a lot of people come on vacation during this week so that they can come and visit the show. And you get a little bit of the atmosphere and the flair of a beach party. Unless, of course, you happen to need 
your hair done. You can also get cotton to color here. Um, yeah, or a shampoo. That's all right. Check this out. This is this is pet shampoo from Paul Mitchell. You yeah. have? Uh, I've never tried it. No. Oh. No, but it looks and look full body wipes for their pets. I could eat. Boy, my dogs could yeah. eat some of those, man. This is kind of cool. Smells Teeth and gum wipes. Good. Smells good. Ear and eye yes. wipes. Or you can buy a bed here if you like, complete with pillows and duvet. Um, most embarrassing story, at, at Den Bosch a few years ago, this, there was an exhibition of these types of beds, and I lost my dog, Gizmo, and I found him sleeping in one of the beds. And I said, I was so apologetic to the guys, oh God, I'm so sorry. I said, oh, don't worry, it's good advertising. Well, you can get makeup here too. Yeah, it's okay. Or a shavings fork. Well, there's something you don't see every day. That's a green bridle. Or baby blue. Or red. So this is the warm-up arena for our dressage. And it's actually quite the gathering point. Um, you'll be reminded again and again of a, of a beach party at this horse show because everybody takes vacation to come to it. And just behind this fence here is the Versace Stadium. Falsterbo this year is one in the series of the Exquis World Dressage Masters horse shows, so it's a CDI five star. Okay, I want that one. It's paper and uh, I don't know what it is. And tape, yeah. Tape, tape. Mm. Masking tape, yeah. we say in English. It's a handmade mulberry paper. I can't okay. the artistic colors. Yes. Yeah. Okay, and it turns out like this. Yeah. Or like this. My own technique. Or like this. Yeah, I love this. Those ones. Yeah. So there's a six-year-old test taking place right now. One of the things that I love about this show is that they play the music so loud. You really get a feeling of party and beach atmosphere.